This is good for vegetable carving. Oh, I like this. Nice. Are you guys going to use the snow peas? We're going to do those. Okay. This is me cooking. All of it? Like this. Yeah. Very thin. Push them in a little bit. Push them in. Okay. You see how it's called? They're already starting to fiber green. Yeah. It's starting to come out. With some green vegetables, you can even add like some baking soda in there, and that'll kick up the enzyme, and you'll get more of a vibrant green with them. So how do you tell when they're done? Well, you can taste them. That's usually how most people do. They'll taste it, eat it. Or, I mean, they do very, if you cook it anymore, they're going to start to get brown in color. Okay. So that's a good determination. So you're looking about like a minute, a yeah. minute and a half? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this was the grilled so, roasted red pepper. Yes. Oh, nice. So you see how this side it's not it's still it's almost doesn't look like it's cooked at all. Oh yeah. Yes. This side you can tell it's very blistered. Oh, yeah. This is your roasted red pepper, guys. Very nice. So how long do you have to keep it? I do want to taste that and taste the difference of the grill. In the water. I'm going to put this on my sheet pan over here so we can taste the way on it and cut it off. Perfect. Um, just until it's cold, finger touch cold. You don't want it to be warm. So what we're yeah. going to do... Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put it in. Uh, we'll grab this little sheet pan over here. And you can turn the sheet pan. You can even use the wire whisk again. Oh yeah, that would make sense. It's always a cut this small. We can yeah. and so Perfect. Okay. Beautiful, guys. You guys ready to cook? Hello. Yeah. You guys ready to cook? Very nice. nice. That's perfect. Ranch okay. broccoli. Very vibrant. Should we taste it? Well, yes. we, we can taste That's it now. Right. We'll put them over here and taste them. Make sure you oh, change right. your gloves and <laughs> wash your hands. <laughs> I got trash on there if you want to taste that. Water very nice and salty. Salty seawater? Well, they just blanched broccoli in there, so you might want to re season it. Okay. To make sure. Yes, Chef. I would definitely do that. There's some salt. I think there we go. What did you put in the sandwich? Uh, I think there was only two of them, so I'll have to maybe get some more. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what's it all Thank you. That was uh, Team Singapore over there. <laughs> you know I have to represent oh, yeah, over here. <laughs> my Asian uh, culture. <laughs> I love it. I'm going to marry an Asian guy. Oil. Oh, 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 Good job. Good job. And you see even Mary over here, how you this was clear water before. Yeah. And then you dip them into the the broccoli the water. You almost see how like some of that green. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So it gets to a point where it's fading, but that's yeah. Pretty, that's it's beautiful. perfect, yeah it is. And that's why if you start to cook them anymore, you're gonna lose that green color. So it's really almost like your eye and you gotta taste it to see where it is. Okay. So we cut our potatoes and we made an observation that they're turning brown. They didn't know why they were turning brown after we cut them. That would be my mistake because I forgot to tell you guys that with uh, potatoes, they start to turn brown if you don't put them in water right away. But Thank you, sir. luckily we can hurry up and start to cook them before they get or we can just leave one out and we can see how brown it can get. Leave one out and we'll demo how brown it can get later on. So we really don't want to cook these too long. So we'll 
what is it? Yeah, a little bit of a Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah. So you can play so. the turn once. Cyril and Mary, make sure you guys don't forget about your super because they're in the room. Oh no, we want to catch on fire. Got, got oh, okay. That's sort of the objective here. Is that okay? I just want to make sure that we feel completely on fire. <laughs> no, there's no regular oil. No, I think we are just taking them. Just yeah. slash uh, it from there. You got the cleaning crew coming in right now, right? Yeah, of course. That's why you guys come to school, so you can learn how to clean and cook at the same time. Yes, yes, Anna, we have tongs over here. Thank you, Welcome. Enjoy. Are you using the uh, water, too? The boiling salt water? Yes, sir. It will be blanching and smoking. Uh huh, blanching and smoking. Sauteing, what are we sauteing here? I'm going to make some candy carrots. Candy carrots. And your other technique? Blanching. Blanching. And I'm going to make a grill. Grill. I'm going to grill my zucchini. Got it. I'm going to show you something. You're going to show me something about it. Alright, wonderful. I don't know, these guys are using soy sauce and the zucchini. I think it's pretty impressive. Yeah. Good thing you guys are working with teams. Teamwork makes the dream work. It's true. Two brains are better than one. Depending on the thickness of it, it's going to vary. Um, but put this over. See how this is almost like raw. It's still very orange. Yeah. Kind of shows it's a little raw, but this side, it's time to leave the orange color. So it's going to cook. The blue point is going to be warm. Oh, the hot yeah, the hot spot. Yeah. See what's kind of like lighter in color? Yeah. It's usually they communicate better. Do you have the aluminum for this that you got before? I think it's up here. Oh, oh man. Let's check in our roasted red pepper. You know, that's looking good. So you can almost see on the roast red pepper, and if you have two seconds. Yes. On the roast red pepper, we started, it's not completely starting to peel off, but you see how the skin is not, it's easily coming off. That's a good indicator that, I mean, it's cooked, and then you can slice in the next few ends, and it goes well, I mean, you're, you're roasting, I might have your cheesesteak, if you will, again. It's sweating in there. Oh, okay. Okay. We're caramelizing my carrots that I'm going to. So what's the difference between caramelizing and burning? The difference is that it's nice and brown, not black. Oh. So these are starting to. Where is the sugar spread before they get to burn? These are some of them. Yeah, so I would think so. So let's grab a sheet pan. You can even put them on that same sheet pan as your uh, broccoli if there's room. If there's room, if not, it's all right. Or even if you use this pan where we have a yeah. 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 Yeah.